here's the bracket that I made for my shifter. Some quarter inch plate. Got the three mounting holes for the tail shaft housing. This one I ground down. And I ground down a bolt. So it's flush. Because the shifter goes over top of this. And I got the two drilled and tapped holes, three eighths for the shifter to mount to. Got a clearance for the end of the tail shaft housing. So I'm gonna throw this in there. Should be good to go. I got the shifter mounted in the car. Took a little while, but I think I've got it pretty good. So, goes all the way up, doesn't hit the floor. All the way down, it barely starts hitting the floor there. But it's at the stop on the shifter, so it should be good. Got my shifter knob on there. I had to make an adapter. Just made a half inch fine thread on the lathe. Then drilled it out and drilled it for, um, tapped it for a 3 8 fine thread. So I can put my half inch shifter ball on there. So that's in there. Gotta make a mount bracket. So I got that made, just some quarter inch plate. I'm gonna Swiss cheese it so it doesn't weigh a ton after I get all this finished up. But the shifter's in there. Now I'm working on the shift rods. So I had these rods in there, but these are actually in really good shape, so I didn't want to cut them up. So I went and grabbed my other shifter, and you can see these are pretty worn, so I don't feel too bad about cutting them up because I need work anyway. And this is the 2-3 shift one. Cut it, took three inches out of it, welded it back up. And got it all lined up. So it turned purple, so it got good penetration, so it should be good. And wherever it just fell, made up some bushings. So these are just regular steel. It's a half inch outside diameter, three eighths inside diameter. And these are gonna go on there because the shifter has a half inch hole in it. So I made those so that that'll work. Eventually I'd like to make my own tubular ones with heim joints, but I was looking online and people are using spacers and all this stuff to make them work. And I don't wanna deal with that right now. So just using these stock ones and kinda of making them work so this is the shorter one I made because I moved the ended up moving the shifter I don't know where it's supposed to be originally but I think the um the hearse kit actually came with new rods but anyway it's getting there